challenging themselves to get healthy. Well, with one week under the belt, we wanted to know what will keep them motivated once the novelty wears off. WDEF News Source Joe Legee continues the story in this fit February report. How's it going? Hard. Come on, Marty. <laughs> After grinding it out one to two hours a day at Scenic City Boot Camp, it's back to the scales for these 12 to see how their hard work paid off. And today she's at 433.6. Good job. <laughs> Carrie Huff lost over 13 pounds, posting a 3% reduction. Over the course of one week, she's gone from working out in a chair to actively participating. Before I came here, I didn't move at all, so just getting out and doing what I've done is really paid off. Robert Starr has posted the second best number on the scales this week. He's also probably the most gung-ho among this group trying to get healthy. Robert hits the gym twice a day, offering encouragement to his partners in perspiration. My father told me a long time ago, no matter what you're going to do, if you're a ditch digger, be the best ditch digger you can be. Robert's enthusiasm didn't develop overnight. The long road to this point started about two years ago. After appearing in a News 12 segment on fitness video games, his daughter Jessie hid his cigarettes. And when my daughter looked at me, she said, Daddy, I want you to live longer. Her concern caused him pause, resulting in two promises. One was to quit smoking, and the second was to get healthy. Uh, June uh, 7, 2009, I gave up a three-pack-a-day habit smoking. But Jessie wouldn't live to see her daddy keep those promises. She passed away after suffering a brain aneurysm. I know my daughter's with me spirit. Uh, I know that for a fact. She knows how hard I've struggled with this. No way. This is commitment to her and to myself. Did I fulfill my promise? Robert says it's time to complete the promise. And now that he's on this journey, and I'm not stopping until it's done. In Chattanooga, Joe Legee, WDEF News 12. Tomorrow night at 6, we turn our attention to food because diet and exercise do go hand in hand. How much time does it take to work off a slice of pizza? In the math factor, we crunch the numbers, putting a calorie count on the foods and drinks we consume regularly. Some of the additions will give you pause. 